hey guys welcome back so in this video we are going to see how to create a custom user registration form in Django so in the previous video we had seen how to register user using the default registration page which Django provides so we don't want to show all these things so we'll be using a custom uh, user registration form so let's get started with it so this is the normal registration URL which we had created so first we'll go to forms and we'll create a form here okay so we'll call class and we'll give custom user create or we'll give register custom user register and here you have to not give model form you have to give the user creation form which Django provides we'll be modifying that and using so from Django dot contrib dot auth dot forms import user creation form and copy this form and paste it here okay so as you know inside this I have to create a class meta and here we have to mention the model name that is model and here the model name will be user which is inbuilt and you have to just include that also so from django dot contrib dot auth dot models import user and the fields so you can see the fields here what are the fields that is username password and confirm password so I want to take the email also along with the uh, these three details so it's already there in the database so here it is SQL light in the further videos I'll show you with my SQL database so we have a user interface for that graphical user interface where the table will be visible and we can check the column names so for here we'll give the username and email and the password and confirm password name is simple password 1 and password 2 okay use the same thing password 2 these are the four fields which I want to take while registration so now we'll go to the views function sorry views file and to the register function so here is the registration function and here instead of giving user creation form we'll import that which we just created now so we might already have imported from forms blog form and here so I have given the name custom user register so that these two don't uh, get clashed or we don't get confused with it so just copy that and user creation form just paste it over there ok so now this should work so let us go and reload the page reload it's loading I guess let us check if there is some error just again run the server so what is the error let us load and we'll check it so it shows no error and you are able to see these things are there okay form and the email address password and this so we just need to design this using the form control of bootstraps class so we'll go here and as we had done in the previous thing I'll just copy and paste it here and this will be the username so give username and the same thing class will be and we can add a placeholder also here give comma and give placeholder colon and here will give enter username okay so copy and paste this four times and just give this email and the same thing here also say email this is the password say password this is the confirm password here you have to mention this field name 
so password 2 and this will be the password 1 password 1 ok so here will be enter password and here the, this is just the placeholder so confirm password so now we will reload and check so we have got it so it's the username email password and password 2 so if you don't want to show this password on password 2 you can go to accounts and register.html instead of this form dot as p just give form dot username and you will get the username input box so if you want you can just give username dot label what this does is the label of that input box it will just show here username so if you want you can instead of doing like this you can just give h4 or use the label tag label that is username close the label tag here copy and paste it here okay so username and then email this field just put email and this will be password one give here enter password and just copy and paste this copy paste this will be confirm password this will be the password to field okay so now let us reload and check hit reload so you can see but it's all congested so i just put it in a div here so i have written the code as time was getting extended so it's done now let us reload and check the output so reload just add margin bottom to this I'll just remove this bootstrap classes so it's margin bottom 3 and this will give some spacing okay so it's done so now let us check with register and try so i'll give with prakash and just remove the space at gmail.com password and i just put the simple password so here it's visible just because i have given as input type equal to text okay so here in the forms given text input and just add here itself password just reload and check ok you can see it's not showing so i'll add for this confirm password also so just copy and paste it below this separate it with a comma and now let us register our user here ok it's loading ok so here i give the username as with prakash email at ved at gmail dot com and the password will be and make sure this two password is matching register and registered successfully so user is registered successfully okay so thank you for watching this video guys please like the video and subscribe to the channel thank you once again